Hey folks, how's it going? T. Allen Diaz here. Um, trying something new for 2017. I'm going to try and do these videos. Um, that I think, I hope that this is going to be a good way to get, get, keep you guys abreast of what's going on and maybe, maybe talk about some different issues and, and, you know, hopefully this is take number 576, but hopefully as I get a little better at these videos, uh, I will, uh, I will be able to do it in 10 takes or so. Um, but at any rate, um, there's a lot going on, a lot to discuss, a lot to talk about, uh, and I really don't want to, I don't, I really don't want to take a whole lot of your time to do it. So let's go on ahead and, um, and get on with it. Um, the first and foremost, I want to thank you guys, uh, the fans out there who have supported me and who have, uh, you know, I know you're a small but growing group. Um, thank you to everybody who's taken the time to read my book. Thank you to the books. Thank you guys, everyone out there who's taken the time to share with your friends, to talk, to, 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 to support me. Most uh, certainly to, to write reviews, either uh, Goodreads or Amazon or wherever it is you've taken the time to do that. I cannot thank you enough for that. Thank you very much. Um, you guys are great. There's a lot going on in 2017, a lot to talk about, so let's go on ahead and, and start talking about some of that stuff. Um, first of all, one of the reasons you don't see a lot on, on um, social media, and there's, uh, it's, it's just an excuse. I, I've got to get better at it. But one of the reasons you haven't is because I literally work uh, hours and hours and hours a day, uh, most days. I mean, I, I do take some family time, but, but I mean, I, it is nothing for me to do 10 hours a day uh, working on the different projects that I've got going on. Um, I have been working post-production on two different books. Uh, one of those books is Lunatic City. We'll talk about that in a little bit. But the other book has been The Volga Cell. Um, the Volga Cell is the last, la the final chapter of the Persina story and of the Persina uh, trilogy. And uh, I I'm really excited about this. I think it's a great book. It, 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 is, it is something that I, I you know, I kind of had a, a feel for where this was going, and, and this ties everything up very nicely. Um, I'm really, really excited about it. Um, I took this proof. I've just been through it, done some, done some final edits. Uh, I don't know if you can see that, but done some final edits, put that stuff in the, uh, in the last manuscript, and it is going off to ebook fabricators. Uh, Stephen Barclay at ebook e fabricators. Stephen is... Uh, uh, a great guy that uh, will uh, set up, will, will, will convert your form, uh, your book in any format. Uh, I use Word, and he takes that Word format and he puts it into PDF and he puts it into EPUB and and, and all the other formats that I need for electronic uh, distribution or for uh, um, uh, CreateSpace. When I when I do CreateSpace, which is, PD, which is a PDF file, so he does that. He does he, he spaces everything. He he does a great job. And he is easy, super easy to work with. He has, uh, I feel, very, uh, very good rates, uh, quality workmanship that comes out of those. So uh, that guy, that's the guy you need to, to see about your uh, your ebook, fa your your fabrication needs, your book fabricating needs. Also, um, the artwork. Man, I wouldn't, I'd be remiss if I didn't talk about Alvin Epps and what a talented guy he is. How he has done the cover of every book that I've had so far. And uh, I have absolutely zero regrets of using him. Just look at that artwork. Look at that detail on that book. That that is that is quality stuff that you just don't get anywhere. Just just anywhere. And uh, Alvin is a good guy. Excellent to work with. Another guy that's great with his collaboration. Uh, he 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 has been very open to any any subtle changes that I've wanted to make in in the books. And 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 he's kept it open. His mind open. He's offered. Uh, He's offered some suggestions and, and some inspiration to me, too. So, you know, just a great guy to work with, Alvin Epps. So, um, so, so they, that, that's a good guy to look at. All right, so this is the first completed, first ever fully completed set of the Prusina Trilogy. And it is going to be awarded to the, to the grand prize winner, or at least my grand prize winner, of Lisa Arrington's... Um, uh, holiday blowout. Um, this is a little bit late. I'm sorry about that. But the winner, and it is coming to you, I promise, Melanie Kudlak. Melanie, I love the name. My wife's name is Melanie, so I'm kind of partial. Um, uh, I've waited long enough. We've tried to get the other folks' address. There's some some lesser prizes, but nobody has 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 offered up an address. So I I don't know where to send those books to. So if you've been told that you won. And you won your copy of the, say, uh, Persithian Rain. 
which I had five copies I was giving away. There are five winners. Those folks, I don't have your information. I can't send it. I, I can't go door to door all around the country. <laughs> I can't do that. So I, I'm going to need you to work with me. If you can send me uh, an address, uh, find me on Facebook, PM me, uh, however it is. You know, T. Allen Diaz, uh, I have my own Facebook page. Um, look me up, get your information, or give it to Lisa Arrington, and she will get it to me. Okay? But in the meantime, Melanie, first ever completed trilogy is coming to you very, very soon. Um, I expect it to be the day after tomorrow. I am uh, at my day job tomorrow, so it's going to be kind of hard for me to do tomorrow. Um, but uh, I'm, I'm thinking Tuesday. So uh, we'll get it off in the mail to you, I promise. Okay? Um, and thank you for your patience, and I'm sorry it's taken so long, but, but I've been trying to get everybody together. Uh, also, a lot of stuff in the, a lot of irons in the fire. It, it, it's been a lot going on. Um, I've been doing the post production on that. I've also been penning a uh, fantasy story, uh, a little bit different, epic fantasy, something I, I'm not used to. Uh, science fiction is a little diff, a little, a little different. I, I'm I'm a pantser uh, when I write. I kind of have a beginning. I kind of have an idea where the end is. I may have a scene or two mapped out in the middle, but. Where we go from there, we go from there. I, I don't typically do a lot of outlining. I don't typically do a lot of, a ton of world building, uh, or I haven't had a need to yet. Um, these mainly because uh, um, the sci-fi is just it's just come naturally. It's been a natural evolution from our society into the one that I'm making, so it's not been a, a very taxing. <sighs> Fantasy is a different animal. Um, I'm not going to talk about all the bore you guys with all of that, and I'm not going to bore you with some of it because, you know, I'm doing some research to keep some certain historical aspects of uh, the technology that I'm trying to use accurate. And, you know, uh, I don't want to give too much away, but uh, it's a little bit of a unique twist on fantasy. It's it's not. I'm not going to say it's never been done because there's nothing new under the sun. But, but I, there's not. You haven't seen a lot of this kind of fantasy that I I think that I'm. I, I don't think. So I'm really excited about it. Of course, it's a little bit darker, a little bit edgier, but it, it really wouldn't be my stuff if it weren't. Um, but I'm looking forward to that, and I'm having a lot of fun doing that. And I'm finding myself having to spend a lot of time world building and mapping stuff out and, 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 and doing things that I haven't had to do before. So it's slowing me down a lot in, on the one hand. But on the other, I, 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 I'm really excited. I've got a good feel for where I think I want my characters to go and, and, and their story arc. And... Um, so I'm really excited, and I think this is going to be, I think this is going to go really, really well, because my schedule, my writing schedule, is freeing up a little bit, because a lot of my projects are finally finding conclusions, specifically the Volga Cell is about to be released, done. Um, Lunatic City, I'm about to talk to you about that, that is also going to be done. So, you know, I'll have other things going on. But uh, but I'm going to be primarily writing at that point in time. I'm also going to you're also going to see uh, a much bigger uh, media presence now. And on that note, um, let's get started on the big media announcement. And the big announcement today is Lunatic City, which was previously available, self-published by me, uh, is no longer available. Uh, it is not available commercially at this time because it has been picked up by Wordfire Press. Uh, owned by Kevin Anderson, who's a, a New York Times bestseller many, many times over. Has his own great material in addition to writing uh, uh, his pen stories uh, from the Star Wars universe, from Dune. So uh, he has a ton of material out there. Uh, very prolific writer. I I'm very honored, very privileged to be uh, on the Wordfire team. I'm very excited. Um, I, I, man, I, I, I can't wait. I can't wait to get out there. 2017 is... Man, it, it has the potential to be a banner year, and uh, great opportunity. And, and Kevin, I, I would like to thank you personally for giving me the opportunity to be a part of your team and 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 to uh, and to, uh, to 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 work for you. And I, I hope to. Uh, I, I'm not going to disappoint you. Um, I'll work any event I can. I'll, any any event you'll have me that I can get get out there. I will do it. Uh, and I'll work hard for you, and I'm hoping to get some uh, some quality material to follow up. Lunatic City. So, um, thank you very much for that opportunity. And uh, now for another announcement. I will be with the Word Fire Press team at uh, Pensacon 2017, which is this February 
February 16th to the 19th, uh, which is a Friday through a Sunday. Um, I'm going to be there uh, in, so, in some capacity. I have yet to receive an itinerary. I, I do not know if I'm going to have, which I'm hoping I do, and I'm, I'm, I'm more than willing to, to, to sit on panels and such. But as of right now, I, I know for a fact that I will be working the booth. Uh, I will be there, uh, hopefully, with some of my own material to, to, to sell. If I do not, I will still be 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 there uh, representing and and and, uh, and and selling some great stuff by some great writers. Uh, that is an that is a fantastic team out there at Wordfire Press, and, and I just I, I'm super excited to be a part of it. Um, but I, I'll have more information later. I do not have any itinerary, any schedule as far as things that I'm that I'm involved with directly as far as uh, panels, et cetera, et cetera. So. Uh, I think that's I think that's it. Come see us at the Tower Nerd, uh, Pensacon 2016 or 2017, um, and uh, and uh, stay tuned. There, there's there's stuff happening. There's there's a lot. I'll have more on Pensacon, and I will have hopefully more on. Uh, maybe we'll do some uh, some more information on my my fantasy, which I have a pretty good solid working title that I think I'm going to stick with. But uh, for right now, I think that's I think that's enough. So thank you all for tuning in. Uh, I hope you tune in and stay in touch because uh, there's going to be a lot going on in uh, in 2017, and I, I'm hoping to keep you guys uh, uh, up to date and engaged. And uh, T. Allen is out.